Hello, and welcome to VTC's course on Ubuntu Linux. My name is Chess Griffin. In this tutorial, we will talk about three ways to obtain Ubuntu Linux at no cost or at very little cost. Ubuntu Linux is available for free, as is most Linux distributions. Linux and Ubuntu are generally free software, which means software available at no restriction. Free software does not necessarily mean software available at no cost, although it can mean that. But generally speaking, free software means software that is available under an open and unrestricted license, such as the GPL. Now, Ubuntu Linux is also provided at no cost. It can be available through download, through receiving a CD in the mail, or through third parties. Let's turn to each of these three options one at a time. The first way to receive or to obtain Ubuntu Linux is to download the ISO image. Now, an ISO is an image of the CD-ROM of the operating system. It's almost like a zip file, if you will. It is not the CD-ROM itself. It's an image. It's a, it's a, it's a data file that then must be burned onto a blank CD-ROM. Not copied, but the CD, but the ISO must actually almost be expanded or uncompressed and then rebuilt and, and burned onto a CD-ROM. Most CD-ROM burning programs have this capability. So, the first way to obtain Ubuntu Linux is to download the CD installer. As it says right here, it's nearly 700 megabytes, which again is just about the size of a one blank CD-ROM. This page here shows you the various places you can go to download the Ubuntu Linux distribution. In this particular case, there are different versions that are available, the newest version or an older version with long-term support. There are two options that are available. If one was to choose the newest release, the next step would be to choose a location near where one lives. And clicking these links gives you various websites where the Ubuntu Linux distribution, the ISO, the CD Im image, or the CD installer, all of those mean the same things, where that can be obtained. It also provides instructions on how to burn the CD to a blank disk. The next way to obtain Ubuntu Linux is to use a service provided by Ubuntu Linux that is very unique. It's called ShipIt. ShipIt is a, is a free CD available from Ubuntu itself. Now, Ubuntu only provides ShipIt free CDs for certain releases of Ubuntu Linux. Not every single release is available through a free CD, but this is a very unique service that's not provided by, by many other Linux distribution, and it, it can be used to obtain a CD of Ubuntu Linux for free anywhere in the entire world. And it also has links to other ways to obtain Ubuntu Linux, including from distributors and buying from lar in large quantities and things like that. So the first way to obtain Ubuntu Linux is to click on the download link and download the CD installer or the CD-ROM, the CD ISO yourself and burn it onto a blank disk. The second way is to request a free CD using the Ubuntu Linux ship it program. And the third way is to use uh, a third party vendor. There are many, many vendors out on the internet that will provide you CD-ROMs of various Linux distributions at a very nominal cost. Here is one, for example, that uh, has live CDs and, and CDs for various Linux and BSD operating systems at a very low cost. And they usually provide a list of some of the newer products, but they have an entire catalog as well uh, that can be available. And here are some of the most popular ones, including the current version of Ubuntu Linux. And you can see they have here uh, one CD available for the regular PC platform at $1.95. Very low cost. And, and Ubuntu comes in other platforms, including Mac, 64-bit, and there's also a server edition. So one could just select this and purchase it. There might be a small shipping charge of the CD to your home. But for just a few dollars, these third-party vendors, like this one right here, can provide you CDs delivered to your door. 
However, I would say that most people probably download the CD-ROM from the Ubuntu website or one of the other other websites in, that are called Mirrors uh, for free and burning it onto a, a blank disk. And again, this, this page does provide instructions on how to do that, including uh, how to do it from Windows. And this will be the subject of another tutorial. That's it for this tutorial. Thank you very much.